Hi everyone, Al again. i um, going to go today through uh, electricity um, problems and and if you've got one of these, which is uh, an RCD control board, you quite often find for the slightest reason that um, it trips out. Um, we'll have a quick look at the lighting circuits first, um, if one of those trips out and what the problem might be. Uh, and then we'll look at um, ring mains and what to do if that um, keeps tripping out but we look at light and if you find a certain room um, you put the light on it goes off um, and the trips out you might find a bulb it obviously is the main suspect but if it's not uh, we'll have a quick look at what else it is and I've just found something on mine which I did find it to be and I'm going to show you what it is so I'll take you to that room now okay after first checking um, the light switch was okay and there was no shorts there but which can sometimes be the, the the main light switch and one of the main suspects more than the light switch is something like this now if you look that wire is totally stretched um, the weight of this glass hanging lovely ornamental lampshade has pulled the wires and as you can see up there, the wires are pulled again. Uh, they've actually tripped mine out at the moment because it's pulled so tight there with the weight that the wires have touched together. So this is one to look out for uh, if you find light in one of the rooms is playing about and it keeps tripping off every time you turn it on and you've tried the bulbs. Um, this is a common one. And also those, those fittings there that hold the thing up can also um, short inside. If you see a discoloration, um, a brown, dark brown colour, uh, like a burning stain, you know also that that could be gone and we will probably want changing. And the same with the light rose fitting. If you see any brown discoloration stains there and it looks a bit bad, especially if you get a smell from it, a fishy type smell, um, you know that that will want changing. We move on now to um, our ring main circuits. Normally there's two ring mains going around your house. Uh, two separate circuits with the plug sockets on uh, and what we're going to look at now if you've got a plug socket one that keeps going off on a ring main then what to do how easy to check that and find out what one is playing up and to find a problem most most times this is fairly easy to do and I'll show you how simple it is okay and checking your plug sockets is a fairly simple affair Look for any discoloration on any of the plugs, but nine times out of 10, it's an appliance that is causing the problem. Just unplug every appliance on that ring and then plug them in one at a time until the trip goes. When the trip goes, that is the appliance that is faulty. Chuck it away and get a new one. Now, I know sometimes you might get an intermittent trip and that, that could well be a refrigerator. Again, if you can leave everything out, and wait until it trips and if you can hear that the motor is just tripped on on the refrigerator or even a washing machine if you're using that and it comes on it goes off you know that is where the fault lies just the slightest earthing problem one of the appliance will cause the electricity to trip so just go around all your plug sockets and just check everyone I mean there's nothing there have a good look at them and make sure there's nothing basically wrong with them if you've got nothing that is tripping it out that is evident if but normally most times um, there is an appliance causing this problem and that really is all you've got to do mainly to sort out if there is a major problem after that obviously um, that is beyond the normal remit and you will have to call an electrician in um, you, you can't win them all but do check all the elementary things first with any problem there is usually a fairly simple answer that doesn't involve calling in electricians and spending a lot of money. Just do a little bit of investigative surgery yourself and have a look and try these things and I guarantee nine times out of 10, you will find the problem. Okay, that's it for me. Thanks very much for watching. Derek and 33 for all my um, how to do's and fix things and do whatever you wanna do. Um, they're there somewhere. Okay, thanks for watching.